M0FXB, welcome to my channel. Let's update the firmware on our SDS200 scanner made by Uniden. So first thing we'll do is check the firmware that we've got. So we'll press the squelch button, push it. That gets you into settings. Then the silver button, turn it until to the left until you see settings. Press settings, then turn to the left again and you're looking for scanner information. Okay, it's there at the bottom then press scanner, turn to the right once, firmware information. And that's the two figures we're looking for. And we've even got our serial number, which you would need there if you wanted to upgrade and add things like DMR, which you can do. I'll put this link in as well, look. You can choose your different options here. You've got Pro Voice DMR, NXDN, DPMR. So that link will be there and you add your serial number and then it updates your SDS 200. Back to the firmware, we know what firmware we've got, so the, the easiest way is to download the Sentinel software. So we'll put a link for that, here it is here, Sentinel 2.03, as you can see. So click that and you'll end up with this software here. In this software, at the top, you've got this, says the word update, click update firmware. Let's take the whole page, update, then firmware. Okay, then now at this point we need to connect our cable into our computer. We'll plug it in and the SD200 will automatically see that you've plugged something in and it, you're going to need to push E to sort of activate that connection and tell it, and it will say writing to SD card and you're now showing as a USB mass storage. It's like a giant storage device. We refresh. There you are, it's showing us there. And we can actually up, update now. We can click OK and it will update. But I'm not going to because I've already done it. So I'll cancel that for now. And you can see that also we can look at so many other things. Look, yeah, there's lots and lots with this software. Read from scanner, write from scanner. MOT stroke P25 and things like that. I, I, I'm new to all this. You can import, display, customize settings, export, export Google Earth. Wow. That's brilliant, isn't it? All the locations of the things that you're looking at. I mean, it's a very advanced scanner, probably the most advanced in the world. Options. Reconstruct, I'm not going to do that. Reconstruct full database. I'm just going to cancel that. Target model, that's us. We can select the model we've got. Help. And that's the, we've got the latest, uh, you know, programming software as well. That's all good. So I'll just go through these other links. So that's your download Sentinel. That's your main website. There's Facebook groups for the SDS 200. Well worth it because a lot of them have files. If you look here, got all these files that are going to help you. And there's more than one group. And we have, the other one we've got, which is handy, is this firmware information. If you look at the latest one, 1.21, it tells you, you know, what has been done. And so, and, and even the previous ones, you get a feel for what's been going on with this with this as well. So thanks for watching my channel. Links in the description. Have a go at updating your firmware and um, catch you on air as well, M0FXB. Please remember to hit the like and subscribe button. Seven free.